Hi everyone, in this video we are going to see top 5 websites which will be definitely useful for students, teachers, professors and researchers. Why it is useful? Because through these websites you can get more ideas about your project. That is a project which you have, you wanted to do it as a new one. You will also get an idea for a research. You will find, you will find various articles to identify the research problem for your project or your research and you will get more articles, more uh, thesis, project reports from the literature review. So the very first site which we are going to talk about is what Infotopia. So Infotopia is a website where it describes itself as a Google alternative search search engine. This is an alternative for the Google, but this is specifically designed for the academic search engine. This is an academic search engine which pulls results from varied curated libraries. It will give you research for the teachers and other educational workers. Okay, so a unique search feature allows user to select a category which ranges from art to health science to technology everything so here you can see that here you have various options art biography games health history images you, you can even search for the images and sound files languages literature okay math everything almost for all the topics you can find something so uh, i'm just going to uh, click on um science tech okay so here you can see science project so simply i'm just clicking a science project where you can find various science fair resources here so if i click sciencing okay so it will give you the project which is uh, which ha which is been done by the 11 year old student okay what is the project which is done so this is completely only for the academic purpose okay so this is you can if you are a teacher you can suggest your student to do a relevant project like this okay if we go and take for uh, english if you go and just explore for english so you can see various other options for english so if you go and cl simply click here shakespeare you can see various uh, that is a link which are relevant to shakespeare so this is a good search engine like a Google search engine. Okay, this is also enhanced by Google, but this is specifically for academic and research purpose. Okay, you can enhance, even you can go and check here, type and see what are the relevant searches you have. Okay, I am I have just searched for data science. So here I have two options, web and image. And even in web, you can see that how data science is related with science tech literature codes everything you can find all the options here okay if i simply click here data science training online this is related to data science training which are offered by various um, that is various company which are renowned companies okay this is ninth grade big data science project if you want to get more information about the project then you can definitely make use of this Okay, so this is about the very first one which we have discussed is what Infotopia. Okay, so the next one which you are going to see is what the visuallrc.com. So what is the difference between this Visual LRC that is Visual Learning Resource Center is an online index hosting thousands of scholarly websites. So everything is related and it is really applicable for the teachers professors, librarians, and anyone who is doing their research, okay? And the site provides students and teachers with current valid information for school and university academic projects. This will specifically give you some idea for the project. So here, even here, you can see various options like um, uh, Infotopia, that is what which we have searched now, Teachertopia. So he, from here, you will get more other connections to other uh, websites where you will get a lot of ideas about uh, how to do a project or your thesis or even you may get some idea for your research. Okay, likewise, how we have searched there, you can also search it here. Okay, any of your uh, uh, topic, any topic, okay, you can go and search, you will get more information about it. It is similar to Infotopia. Next, we are going to talk about Eric. Okay, so next one is what? Educational Resource Information Center. 
this is actually populated by the us department of education which is a great tool for academic research with more than 1.3 million bibliographic records of articles and online materials so in eric you can find uh, literatures including journal article research synthesis um conference papers technical reports uh, books policy papers everything here you can find more than 8 million searches each month so here i'm just going to see here you can see this is a collection and this is thesaurus so that is what we will call it as a thesis okay dissertation so even if you want to get some thesaurus from uh, various country you can go and search here okay data mining simply i'm just using the word which i usually use to it so i'm just giving data mining even if you want to just go and search for that you can see what role in what role field they have okay nearly agricultural natural resources almost everything educational process language student and teacher research and uh, theory science and technology you can just simply browse and know everything about it okay satellite i'm just clicking satellite and you can find more information about it okay this is what eric so more information about or else if you want to just go ahead with the collections you can also find more information here so here you will find lot of links from various publication dates descriptor source from where they are just fetching they are fetching from of course very renowned journals and the authors you can find publication type which type you want this is what i told like a journal article reports research everything educational level what type of educational level you wanted to search for audience everything location okay you will be getting the resource from all over uh, the world fine the fourth one which we are going to talk about is what science.gov so uh, this is operated and maintained by the office of science and technical information okay uh, the same one uh, this is like uh, this is uh, a search engine which pulls from over 60 databases over 2200 websites and 200 million pages of journals scientific data and documents you can find even scientific data so i'm just going to show you like i'm just going to search covid analysis using data science okay and i have clicked the search so what happens here how it is picking the data it is trying to get the data from various sources and here you can see that it is not only showing me the link for that but also it is showing multimedia content data okay i can even get the data from here and also the public access okay if you scroll down you can see various other options like and uh, you can see it is collect it it, it finds the collections like uh, nearly 215 collections in you know, a public access if you see data you have various data as well just go and click here you can find uh, the data for that okay so this is how you can search for your your uh, um, thesis your project whatever you are going to do okay so you can get it from there the last one which you are going to see it were worldwide science this is similar to uh, this particular website that is science.government even you will be getting the uh, data as well as the image everything uh, but here you know like uh, you can search based on the language multilingual fine so even if you just go ahead and click here the same thing like i am just clicking covid analysis using data data mining so your data your search will be similar to what we got it in the previous thing okay that is papers here since it doesn't have any uh, data so it is not showing and if it has a relevant data you will also find the data tab so share it with your friends comment it if you have any doubt please comment it Take care stay safe bye bye